everyone, it's me, Estella, and I'm back with another back to school video. Today's video is a mini back to school shopping vlog. I visited Mini So recently and really liked it, so I figured I'd show you guys around. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and find it interesting, and let's get into it. So the first section that I went to was the plushie section. They just had a bunch of different plushies ranging from regular pillows to cacti to reindeer to puppies, bears, etc. And I really liked how big the plushies were and also very, very soft. I think they'd be a great addition to any bedroom or dorm room and I ended up getting the reindeer one for my little brother and I also think they just make a really great gift to a friend. The next section I visited was the eraser section. I'm not really sure about the quality of them, but they seem pretty nice and small, so they definitely fit into a pen case and be very convenient to carry around. Next, I went to the notebook section and my absolute favorite notebook from this entire section was the pillow notebook just because I've never seen anything like it before. On the cover, it shows that you can use it as a pillow if you fall asleep on your desk or you can use it as a armrest if your arm is tired from working on the computer. And I overall just thought it was a very unique and interesting idea, so I ended up getting one. The other notebooks were just regular hardcover notebooks, but they also had very cute designs on the covers. The next section was this sticky note slash pen case section and they had some very artsy sticky notes but I ended up getting the more plain ones. I really liked the, the ones that looked like they were shaped like a cube but were actually just page flags and I also ended up getting these circular ones as well. And in the bottom of this section were a bunch of pen cases. I ended up getting the cactus one but they also had some banana ones as well. So moving on in the store, they had a pretty large section for pens and markers. I really like trying out different pens and markers. So I ended up getting these really cool stackable ones to try out. And I also got some alcohol-based markers and metallic ones. And I also swatched a few in the store, but the rest of the swatches I'm going to make a separate video for. So stay tuned for that. Beneath the pens were these awesome fruit notebooks and they just seem to be great notepads for to-do lists or little memos and you could keep them on your desk or in your desk. And across from them there was also a section with a bunch of different themed pen cases and notebooks such as from Adventure Time, We Bear Bears, and some other shows. And they also had some different themed ones like from cities and maps, etc. The next stationary section was a washi tape and correction tape section and overall they just had a lot of different washi tapes to choose from and correction tapes so yeah. And last but not least, the rest of the store was essentially just different lifestyle items ranging from portable fans to keyboards to iPhone cases, purses, wallets, backpacks, water bottles, snacks, etc. Even for bathroom supplies or just regular items that you wouldn't really think could be cute. And my overall impression of Miniso was that it was very aesthetic and very affordable and I really liked how the store was set up. Everything was in its own section and very neatly organized. And also the actual items were very cute in themselves and there was a lot to choose from. 
I think it's great for back to school shopping or birthday shopping for a friend on a budget. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. All the giveaway information is here at the end. And that's all I have for today's video. So bye guys.